Hello friends, welcome to the next session. Here we are going to discuss Chomsky hierarchy. Let's get started. So friends, the next important short note that we have over here is Chomsky hierarchy. Now this comes as a theory answer in 5 marks for the main exam. So the question over here says, explain Chomsky hierarchy or explain the types of grammar or classification of grammar. Now, as per Chomsky hierarchy, as per the Chomsky hierarchy, grammars can be classified into a total of four types okay this will be a five mark short note as per chomsky hierarchy grammars are classified into total of four types let's discuss the four types in detail so the first type of grammar is my type 3 grammar so right over here the first type is my type 3 type of grammar when i talk of type 3 type of grammar this type of a grammar is called as a regular grammar and the language generated by this grammar is going to be called as a regular language and the automata that is going to work for this will be called as finite automata so the details of it are written over here the next type is type 2 grammar so after this i have my type 2 grammar as far as my type 2 grammar is concerned my type 2 grammar is called as a context free grammar so let me write it over here such a type of grammar is called as a context free grammar cfg okay the language generated is called as a context free language and the machine that is going to be used for generating that language will be called as a push down automata so that completes my type 2 grammar next is type 1 grammar so next we have is my type 1 grammar which i put it in another circle now type 1 grammar was not a part of the syllabus but it is a part of the short note so as far as type 1 grammar is concerned the type 1 grammar is called as a context sensitive grammar so this is basically csg and the language of this grammar is csl that is context sensitive language and the machine which is used for generating this is called as a linear bounded automata also called as lba so that comprises my type 1 grammar so all the problems which cannot be solved using pda can be done using my lba further the last one is my type 0 grammar so i have my type 0 grammar now type 0 grammar is the most rough and tough of all as we know it will be designed using the most powerful machine that we studied called as Turing machine so first and foremost thing whenever you talk of type 0 grammar such a grammar is called as unrestricted grammar The language of the grammar is called as recursively enumerable language also called as REL and the machine which is going to be used for this is called as a Turing machine. So friends these are the four types of grammars which are classified as per Chomsky hierarchy. 
let us revise it they are classified from type 0 type 1 type 2 to type 3 of which the most powerful is going to be my type 0 grammar which will be generated using Turing machine next less powerful would be my the one generated using linear bounded automata the next in the hierarchy down is going to be my push down automata and the lowest one is my finite automata so from this cyclical diagram we do understand that type 0 type of grammar can be capable of generated by using only my Turing machine whereas my type 3 type 2 and type 1 grammar can be very well solved using Turing machine also so Turing machine is capable of solving all of the problems which come in this particular domain my type 1 grammar can solve type 2 and type 3 type of problems also my type 2 can solve type 3 also but not the vice versa case round so in this way we classify the grammar into four types as per the chomsky hierarchy the with this we complete with this short note classification of grammar see you in the next session thank you